Yeah, ha ha ha. You got the hatch out. Hello window. Hello house. That is going up there. And the door, there, you see the hinge there. You shouldn't be able to do that, but. Uh, the door, hatch thingy, which is down there. There it is. Um, I would have cut a gap in that, so I borrowed a saw from work. Uh, it's taking a bit of a trim, I need to charge up my shit. This here, I'm going to unplug it, pull these off, and put it there somewhere. So, let's get to it, shall we? I took that off before the video just because I knew it was going to be a pain in the ass to get off. And guess what? It was! <laughs> okay, I forgot to uh, do any filming, so I got the hatch in again. I got that bolted up there. Um, the, as you can see, you can see the light through it. I cut that there off. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab my angle grinder. I don't want to be bothered. And I cut this little lip of the hinge off there because it curves over a little bit. So what I can do so that piece of wood down there. I can hinge it onto here, and I can run a cable or a small mechanism or something. I've got <laughs> odd brake cables lying around, and I'll run one up through here so that it'll be closed and I don't lose any heat in the winter and then when I do want to turn it on all I have to do pull that thingy this it'll fold up and then I can turn the blower on or what I could do is I can get a piece of sheet metal or maybe it's just a piece of plastic hinge it that's an even better idea I just do that and when the blower comes on it'll just automatically fold up <laughs> it's not like I'm going to be worrying about losing any more heat through these cracks I'm going to sort out this wall I was meant to do that work so I was meant to make up some plates but I forgot <sighs> okay <laughs> that drill I had to drill some holes so I used I couldn't be bothered to take the battery off of there, which is where it is. So I hooked it up to the charger, and it's really, it's one work at the moment because I've walked over and pulled the wires out. So the next thing I want to do is I've got to put that motor and the blowers back in there. Now what I did is I left those two bottom ones in so I can just hook it onto there. And I've got the other two lying around in one of these. There they are. So, we do that now. <sighs> okay, at long last, it is in. And Christ is my back paid for it. And my leg. And this thing here has moved a lot. <laughs> Let's try it out. See if we've got all speeds. That's not a good sound. We've got a vibration somewhere. I think I can tell what that is. There's two screws at the end of that shell, uh, at the end of that blow which I haven't put back in, so let's take them to pull back. We got plenty of air movement. That should uh, get rid of smoking thingies in here. So we'll have to give it a go. I have to make some.